Well, hello there, my fellow miners and crafters, good times. So Oscar here, and welcome back to our creative house build here, where we're building the super rough and s'more house. And in today's episode, we are going to work on our master bathroom. We're going to build one super awesome bathroom. So let's get this episode underway. And welcome back to Scar World, where we're building our super awesome s'more house. As you can see, looking super fancy over here and look at all the different rooms starting to fill in throughout the house you can see in through the windows and see the different furniture beds couches and all sorts of other great stuff and let's head right in because we've got to work on our master bedrooms bathroom so of course in our last episode we built the room we've got ourselves a floor we've got ourselves couches and of course the most important part of a bedroom the bed of course we've got our bed there looking very cool and let's head inside here because this is our bathroom so we're gonna get right into it today and we're gonna start laying out the floor so we're gonna start getting the floor out here all lined up and ready to go so of course as you can see this is kind of the design that we kind of ended with last uh, episode was you know we've got one two three four and then a spacing of two for a door and then two blocks there and then one two three four five six seven and then one two three four five six seven eight so as you can see, that's our design for now. There we go. And I'm going to bring this all the way across to here. As you can see, I'm leaving that spot right there open for now because that will be our shower. And I'm not exactly sure how big the shower is actually going to be. So we'll kind of play it, play it by ear there and figure out how we want to do it as we kind of move along a little bit. There we go. And I'm just going to make a quick threshold there. Beautiful. Wonderful. Awesome. OK, so let's see what we've got here. Let's start working on some design and getting things all situated. So I think I'm going to run a little pillar going across here. Look at that. Looking fancy. All right. And then I'm going to take some half slabs. If I can sample some. There we go. Grab some of those. And then I'm going to run this along here. Now for this room, I don't know if we're going to do a skylight. We've been doing skylights in all of the rooms. Um, for this one, I don't know if we will. I think we, we might skip the skylights and try something a little different. Um, I think this will be really cool. I've got a nice idea for the sink vanity area. I think we can do a really nice design there. And of course, we're going to incorporate a bathtub, a shower, a toilet, all the things that you would expect from a bathroom. Okay. And then we're going to cut in here like so. There we go. Looking good. Looking good. And I'm just going to make it just wide enough for me to fit through. There we go. And then I'm going to put that as a temporary block and then run that across there. Widen that a little more so I can get through. Beautiful. And then I'm going to cut that out of there. And once again, it's raining because this is a creative world. We're not going to put up with that rain. No, we are not. We're going to get rid of it. There we go. Beautiful. Awesome. Look at that. I think we should do it up here too. Yeah, that look cool. So now we have a window. So we got a nice window still keeping our privacy being, you know, way up in the air like that. Looking good. Awesome. Okay. Next thing we're going to do, we're going to work on our bathtub. We're going to start right here. And we're going to run that across here like that, as you can see. So that's, a, that's one, two, three, four, and then come back over here like so. And there we go. We've got ourselves a bathtub. And then I'm just going to fill our bathtub up. There we go. Looking good. Wonderful. Okay. And then we're just going to make a quick spout for the bathtub, of course. So we're going to put that right there. I'm going to cut that out, place that like so. And I'm just going to take a little pot and I'm just going to put a little fern there. Wait, I lost my pot. Where's my pot? I always lose my pot. Where'd it go? There it is. Wonderful. Oh, that magical inventory. Look at that. Looking good. Actually, let's move that over one. There we go. Looking good. Wonderful. Awesome. Okay. Now we got to work on our vanity area. So let's let's kind of work with this a little bit. Let me grab out a solid block. There we go. And then I am think I'm going to go up two blocks like so. And then I'm going to cut in here like that, as you can see. So hopefully you're following along. There we go. And then I'm going to go from here. I'm going to bring that over to like so. And then I'm going to once again, I'm going to go. Hmm. What I think I'm going to do is I'm going to go like that. And I'm going to bring this up like so. And I'm going to cut this back in like that. So as you can see, it's kind of a nice modern design. It's got a little bit of an artistic, you know, shape to it. And that's kind of the theme we're going with, of course, with this design being a modern house and everything. Okay, and I'm gonna grab myself an item frame. I'm gonna get myself a button. There we go. And then I'm gonna look for a piece of carpet. Now, I think I'm gonna go with the brown carpet. Okay, and I'm gonna place my button and get my button there. There we go, place my other button. There we go. And I'm going to place that in here. So we're just creating a little cupboard door, as you can see. Look at that, how beautiful that is. 
There we go. So those are little cupboards, little storage areas. Let's do another one. What the heck? Let's do another one down here. There we go. We've got time. We've, we've got room. Beautiful. All right. So I'm going to clear all that out of there and I'm going to get out my signature mirror design. Um, wait, I lost my pack dice. There's my pack dice. I knew you were somewhere down there. Always trying to hide from me, aren't you? Always trying to hide from me. Um, let's actually go all the way up. Beautiful. And yeah, I think that's good. Let's sample that. And then we're just going to cut in here like so. And we're just going to create a nice little design in there like that. Beautiful. All right. And then we're going to cut over here and, of course, grab ourselves out a little sink. There we go. Put in our sink. Nice, nice. And I think what we can do also is we can put levers on packed ice. Now, we can't do that on a transparent block of ice, but we can on packed ice. So that's what makes this mirror design so wonderful that we can do something like that because I think that looks really nice. Okay, we need to work on our lighting. So we're gonna grab that and I'm gonna sample you also. There we go. I'm gonna place you down there and place you like that. And we're starting to get our lighting situation. I would love to put some more ferns or something up on the top here, but of course we don't have enough room. So hmm, we'll work with that. We'll work with that. We'll see if there's anything we can do to kind of remedy that if you will. Awesome. Okay, I'm gonna sneak it back here, place that like so, and let me grab a button. Let me clear that out of the way, and of course grab our button. So we've got a lot of blocks, a lot of block placement, but I think we're doing pretty good so far. What do you think of the uh, the design? Of course, if you have any suggestions, if you're like, hmm, Scar, I think you could change that and reorient that or change a different color, definitely let me know. I love hearing your guys' feedback. Love hearing your guys' feedback. There we go, on our designs, because that's how we make our designs the best they can possibly be with lots of feedback and different uh, trial and error. There we go. Never be afraid to take, you know, advice and things of that nature from people. You know, sometimes, you know, we can, you know, be really proud of something. We're like, yes, I think that's the best thing it could possibly be or something along those lines. Um, but you know what? It might not always be the best thing, and sometimes it's really good to get really good constructive criticism. And that's what I always, you know, hope that you guys give me, you know, with videos or, you know, designs and things like that. Give me your, your honest opinion, you know, if you like it, if you don't like it, how you want to change it. Because that's how you get better, you know. You don't want people just telling you, oh, yeah, it's okay, yeah, it's nice, but not, you know not actually being that nice because then how are you supposed to know how to get better how to improve in life and things of that nature there we go and then let's see now what we're going to do is we're going to run this a little shower across here there we go looking cool looking cool yeah because if there wasn't feedback you know back especially when i was you know first starting out on youtube i would still be running my old you know iPhone head, you know, earbuds, headphones for my microphone and stuff like that. You know, it's very important to get feedback, but as long as that feedback comes from a good place, you know, as long as the people that are, you know, providing you this feedback is, you know, looking out for you in your best interest, not being, you know, rude or, um, you know, things of that nature. It's very important to get feedback, but also get feedback from, you know, good constructive place. Um, that's very important. There we go, and looking good, we're really filling this place in. All right, so I got an idea. I got an idea. So let's let's see let's just see how this works. One of my favorite things about a shower is a rain shower, and that's what we're gonna try to do. So a rain shower is something that goes vertical like so, and then the water falls straight down and kind of giving this rain kind of cascading water feel. It's really cool than having just a spout, you know, right here shooting water out. It's a cool feeling. I've um, I felt that one time, I think, maybe, maybe it's one time, I can't remember, I think it was maybe the Queen Mary when I was like, I don't know, 13 or something, I thought it was like the coolest thing of all time when I uh, saw that rain shower, I was like, whoa, that's so cool, all right, there we go, and then let's see, and yes, the Queen Mary, my friends, is one of the scariest places of all, there's ghosts, and it's freaky, I don't know if you guys have ever been, but I don't know. I'm not even sure I would even recommend it. <laughs> not just kidding. It's awesome. It's just very, very, very scary. I was absolutely petrified the entire time we stayed there for a night. Um, it was very scary. <laughs> All right, let's see. Um, I want to build a window. I want to build a window. You might be thinking, Scar, that window is in a shower, and that is kind of weird. I agree, but also what we could do, like we've talked about before, is use our imagination and say that these windows can be go opaque when we want them to when we want natural light coming through the windows we uh, have them open but when we want our privacy we push a little button and a little electrical charge turns the window opaque and you can't see through it 
super awesome. Problem solved, privacy solved. There we go. And then let me see, let's grab out a cyan towel. There we go. I'm just gonna put a little towel right there, looking fancy. I'm gonna place another one right there, looking good. All right, so give me one second. Let me kind of catch my breath and I'll be right back. Oh, welcome back. Just enjoying the hot tub here. Ah, oh, it's very warm and very nice. All right, but we have work to do. So let's get out real quick. And what we're going to do here is we're going to go boom, bada, bam, and then we're going to fill in like so. And then, of course, we're going to go hot and cold. There we go. Now we've got ourselves an on and off switch for our shower. Looking very fancy. Now we're going to clear all that out of there. And yeah, there we go. We've got our bathroom nearly complete, but we have a little bit more work to do out here, of course. And this is our closet. So we need to freshen this area up just a little bit. So what we're gonna do here is we're just going to go one up like that. There we go, cut those in like so, beautiful. And then I'm gonna go in my magical inventory and look for, there's my stairs. And I'm gonna grab out a little bit of carpet. There we go. And then I'm just gonna put some carpet along there like so. And then I'm gonna come in here like that. There we go, cut those in there like that. Beautiful, awesome. And then I'm gonna head on over here. I might reverse those. I may be a little dyslexic and I might have put those in the wrong orientation. Um, so that's a thing. Um, let's see, there we go. Let me put these item frames like that or armor stands. There we go, put those along there like so. And then this is our closet. Looking very cool and fancy. So let me swoop that over there, put that right there. Beautiful, awesome. We've got ourselves a closet all set up and ready to go. Now all we need to do is bring in the clothes, get all the clothes all sorted and ready to go and get that all ready so we can do our tour. So let's get that all done and we can do our tour. All right, and welcome back. And we've got ourselves a master bedroom and bathroom and closet all set up and ready to go. I've only got a few costumes set up here, just a couple. We'll fill this in a lot more as we move along here. And as you can see, we've got ourselves a really cool bedroom built up here. And of course, what we've worked on this episode, our bathroom, we've got ourselves a shower with a rain head at the top. And of course, on and off switches, got our little window there all set up and ready to go. And our beautiful vanity with our mirror and different cupboards and a really kind of interesting interesting architectural style to it and of course our bathtub right there looking cool and what bathroom wouldn't be complete without a toilet of course we've got that all set up and ready to go and hopefully you enjoyed today's episode and if you did a rating would be much appreciated and until next time this has been good times with scar and i always really appreciate you guys taking the time to watch my videos and we'll see you later so i would like a couch to kind of run along this section through here there we go, I'm gonna cut that out for now. And I think I'm gonna run it to about 